Welcome back to the channel gamers. Now in my last Minecraft video, I built a conduit so I could uh, breathe underwater and get some prismarine blocks for this design that I'm trying to build. It's a design that I got from my subreddit for my turtles. I also made my first ever potions, some water breathing potions, and I was making them one by one. And after posting the video and checking the comments, I'd say probably about 100% of them were like, you're an idiot, you can make three at once. So next time I use a brewing stand, I'll, I'll keep that in mind. But what I want to do today is I want to finally build those areas for my animals. I mean, I was going to do it in the last video. It's just that I needed the prismarine block. So it ended up just being another mission. This chest became messy real quick, didn't it? Oh yeah, lapis. That reminds me. When I was building the uh, shrine for the Holy Llama, when I was copying the design from my subreddit, there was this blue block. I didn't know what it was. And in the video I said, and I think there's some water blocks. Well, I don't know how to get the water blocks, but I, yeah, I called it a water block. And you can imagine how people felt when they heard that. But they let me know that it was a lapis block. So let's make four of them. I mean, come on, in the screenshot, it looks like a block of water. I wasn't thinking, okay, I, I didn't think of lapis. Well, there's that then. That makes it look a little bit better. It's still not finished, actually. Oh God, are they making out? Oh, that's disgusting. It looks better than it did before I upgraded it. Look, this is why I'm building stuff for my animals, because they're just walking around. I need them in actual areas. So the first thing I'll upgrade, though, is this. So what do I need, then, for this? Right, so he's using some sort of wood. And he didn't actually use prismarine bricks. He used prismarine blocks. Oh, well, I'm using bricks. Let's go get some wood, then. I'm just going to go up my watchtower and fly over there. Can't be asked to run. I love using this thing. It is so amazing. And it just reminded me, I'm going to make some fireworks, if I can, in this video. Because I think you can use the elytra at any time. I don't think you need to jump off a ledge. There's the dark oak. I love these trees because look how big and thick they are. You can get more than a stack from two trees. I'm not actually sure if I'm going to have enough prismarine bricks to make this. I'd really rather not have to go back, but sometimes in this game, you got to do what you got to do. Right, how many we got? Okay, we've got nearly two stacks already. I'm just going to get two, I think. Where are we going exactly? I think it's that way, isn't it? Oh, come on. God, I suck at using this thing. It's so simple, you just jump off a ledge and press A, yet I still can't use it. Okay, let's go to the villager's crafting table. God, does it, how many iron golems are in here now? I think, ooh, oh, there's a witch. I think it struck a villager, didn't it? Oh, there's two witches. So, can, oh shit, my bad villager. Oh god, that iron golem's coming after me. I'd play that run music right now, you know, that overused run. Dun, 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 dun. Well, we'll go to the nether and then back just so the effect of the iron golem wears off. I think that's the easiest way to make them forget that, you know, you've attacked them. Is it? Or does he st I think he's still after me, isn't he? Oh, okay. I've been kicked out of my own village. The village that I turned from a ghost town to a thriving village with hundreds of villagers, gave them jobs, gave them beds, gave them food, brought animals back to it, protected it with a wall. I've been kicked out of it. The disrespect is unreal. It's weird because every time that happens, that's happened a few times now. Every time I go to the nether and come back, they usually forget that I've attacked the villager. Why isn't it working this time? Do I actually have to step foot into the nether? Let's try this once again. Is he still there at the door? Oh no, I think he's walking back. No, he's not. Okay, I'm gonna go to sleep. Hopefully he forgets by the morning. Okay, you know what? I didn't want it to have to come to this, but you've left me with no other choice. You made me do that. How much iron did I get for that? Four. Come on. You should be able to get all your iron back after that. Right, so are like any more gonna come after me or am I good now? So we'll start on this side. Here. Okay, I should have cleared my inventory out. There's nothing I hate more than having a full inventory of random crap. So it's looking like... Oh, it's looking good. He did use prismarine bricks, so maybe I'll replace them one day. But for now, this is like a good placeholder, you know? Right, now this is where things get a bit funky. Because this is where it actually becomes a ship. Oh god, my turtle is actually out of the water. I'm building these things to keep my animals in a specific area, and this one doesn't even do the job. Oh, they're both moving now. Whatever we do, we cannot let the turtles escape. If they escape without knowing and they go all the way over there, it's gonna take years to get them back. Okay, so it looks like that or something. I don't know. Okay, well, it's all right for now. We'll change it if it needs work. Now, it's not done just yet. Like, all this needs to be sand. So let's go get some sand. I'm gonna put the fences back down because they can escape. There we go. Now they're trapped in here. There's a fence going around the whole thing. We need some bamboo as well. 
and some like weird plant thing and we need some like lanterns do i have any lantern i've got three actually so that isn't going to be enough what do you need to make a lantern like some iron and a torch what the f is that an iron nugget or something iron nugget yeah okay that's easy to make then here's the bamboo and here's the sand now i always underestimate the amount of sand that i need so i'm gonna get two stacks i always get some and then i think oh, okay that'll be enough then i always end up coming back right how much we got now then two stacks okay there is an ender bitch over there where i was but i'm gonna spare him okay so we only need to put sand here apparently the reason they weren't moving is because they need to lay eggs i personally think that is bullshit because well they're moving now and they haven't laid eggs i think it's more of a weird glitch that happens okay now let's put the bamboo down oh i don't like it how it's uneven like that that makes me feel a bit weird he's got some weird plants as well but i don't know what they are so i'm not going to get them you aren't you don't belong in here and wait you're not even going to be able to get Get back out now because there's a fence how what get out now let's put these lanterns down wait 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 oh my god can you guys ah! well done you're trapped there's no way out you buffoon i'm gonna build like i'm gonna just make a, like a little gap so they can't jump over it okay well it's not done because there needs to be a few more lanterns so i'll go and make them but then i think this is pretty much done hold on you know what we need to do we need to get some new armor there we go fresh diamond armor we've also got to make some uh new tools 52 diamonds okay we've still got a bit we've still got a bit it's it's not great but we'll go and get some more oh my god is that another oh my it, it it's another well we need to take him into the house because we're built i mean my basement is now it's basically just a collection of zombies zombie nether pigs that come into the overworld so let's go get the boat out and bring him in these guys are coming out way too quick now like they're coming out near enough every episode i like to think of these guys as family like they're not just nether they're not just random nether pigs okay what I hit the bottom of the boat. It should be getting him out. You know, one thing that needs to be fixed in this game is getting animals out of boats. You can hit the paddle of the boat when a panda's in it and it'll damage the panda. <laughs> what? Just a bit further. There you go. No. Oh, he's trying to escape. Imagine if one day I accidentally attack one and then every single one of them just slaughters me in the basement. Well, it's always nice to add another one to the collection. I know, the reason I came back was to make some more iron nuggets. Also, in the last video, I said, um, I said something like, I said something like, Zoom, he's pregnant. And people picked up on the fact that I said he's pregnant. Guys, are you forgetting that villagers are all male? yet they still breed. Come on, I think that's what we should really be focusing on, not the turtles. So I guess the next thing I'll build is the thing for my pink sheep. It's like this really cool little, like, just fenced off area, but it's got the face of a pink sheep, and I think it looks really cool. Now, the only problem is I don't think I have enough wool. I've got 19. Do I not have any in any other chests? I don't actually even know how to dye wool. Ah, we've got 11 here. What's that? Black wool. Okay, I don't even need to dye this one. We need two black... Oh, wait, there's another 14. Wait a sec, did he just say you can get wool from string? Oh my god, you can make wool from string. Well, looks like we're gonna have enough wool after all. We've got 61 now. Right, so you need pink tulip flowers to dye wool pink. Where, should, where do I even begin to look? For some random flower. I know you can get wool from using shears. So I could use shears on my two pink sheep. But does it come back though? That's the thing. Oh, this has got to be it. This is pink. Come on, don't disappoint. Lilac. I'm guessing this is the same thing. No, it's not. <gasps> okay, I think we found it. P yes, this is one of the ones that you need. Oh, there's a pillager down there. What? Oh, there's a captain. Oh, no, we're going to have to do a raid. I said, oh, no, but I'm actually secretly loving it. It's because there's a pillager tower near here. And I remember I was looking for the... Where is it? It's down here, isn't it? It's over there. Some Yeah, there it is. And I remember there was one video where I was actually looking for this guy, but I could not find him. Oh, what? Where's he gone? He's dead. Wait, wait, what? How did he die in that short period of time where I went over here? Well, that's weird. I actually really wanted to do a raid, but now I can't because he's dead. This is so bullshit because I've wanted to do a raid for a while now so I can get stuff from, you know, so I can get stuff from it. The last time I got a bad omen effect, I accidentally walked near a village, like a random village, but I didn't want to do the raid at that village because I had my inventory full and I wasn't at home, so I couldn't take anything back with me. So that's how I lost the first raid. And, and then I've just just lost this one because he randomly died right so i think that's all the flowers i'm gonna be able to get can't see any more i'm gonna go back home because i'm out of food let's go up the scaffolding and just fly back hmm <laughs> 
don't even have the elytra. That probably won't be such a good idea. I guess while we're here, actually, I should probably get some wood because it looks like it uses quite a lot of oak wood, actually, this design. Why can't oak trees be thick? We'd be doing a raid now if that pillager didn't die. There it is, pink dye. Eight pink wool. Oh my god, eight pink wool. That's not good. There's eight on the first side, so we need at least 16 for the face. Then we're going to need way more for the floor as well. Well, eight, though, is better than zero, so let's go make it somewhere. I don't know where I'm actually going to make it. I need to extend my village wall. So I have like more space to build things, but I might build it here. I think I'll build it here actually. There's nothing here. So let's see. Let, we're building the face first. Three, four, five, six. Oh, it's coming along nicely. Look at this. This looks great. And then it's one, two. Then it's another block of that. Now we don't have any black wool. We're gonna have to leave that empty for now. So we need some pink wool to fill out this side. We need a piece of black wool there. And inside is gonna be like this little house thing. So what do you need to make black wool? Oh, you need an ink sack, that's it. Or you need a wither rose. And I'm guessing a wither rose is found in the nether and only the nether. Oh, dolphins. That reminded me, we still need to get dolphins into the village. I will do it at some point soon. Where are the squid? Where are they at? I like how when you need them, they're nowhere to be found. When you're not looking for them, you know, when you don't actually need them. They're just everywhere. None. Not a single squid. Does that mean I've got to go get a wither rose? Well, it looks like there's actually quite a few flowers over here, so let's just go investigate. All we need is about four flowers to make the face, that is. I can replace the floor of it as time goes on. Going on an adventure for pink flowers. You will only find this on the Polar Source Extra YouTube channel. Oh, there's a black, there's a black sheep. Yes, I don't even need to look for a wither rose anymore. Right now, all we need is the pink flowers. Come on, just spawn some for me, Minecraft gods. I honestly, I don't think you, they, they spawn in a certain place. I just think they're random. Come on, spawn. Right, I think I'm going to give up looking for these. I've got black, I've got white, but I don't have the remaining pink going home empty-ended. Whoa, forest fire. The fuck's going on down here this place is burning down for 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 what reason is it i well it's probably got something to do with that hasn't it oh my god battle witch versus skeleton who's gonna win it looks like the skeleton's got this one he's keeping his distance he's shooting the witch not letting him get close the witch is not close enough to use his attack and the skeleton is keeping him back looks like the skeleton is gonna win at any time now looks like the <laughs> Fuck off i'm watching a battle <laughs> Oh, the skeleton's missed a shot. Witch gets a bit closer, but he's pushed him back to where he was. Witch still hasn't had the chance to use his potion. Oh, he's missed two shots. Oh, he threw the potion. It hit the skeleton. Skeleton has an effect on him. Not sure what kind of effect that is, but it doesn't seem to be affecting him. Skeleton is still firing the shots. And it seems like this witch is actually fucking invincible because I've been watching this battle for about 20 minutes and it still hasn't ended. Right, well, I think I'm going to leave you guys to it. If I had to choose, I'd say the skeleton took that one. I've got to be careful with how much I'm falling now. I had feather falling on my boots, but I don't have it anymore. Maybe I could enchant it, actually, when I get to level 30. Right, we're back home, and all we got from that was one black wool. Let's look at it on the bright side. We've got the other eye. Now, it's got, like, a fence that goes up on this side of it. Okay, is that... Yeah, that looks right. Now we'll make the back of this place. So I can't see what he did for the back of it. So I think I'm just going to make it out of wood. Like it looks good from the front, but looks shit from everywhere else. But who cares if you can't see it? We're never going to be going in here. So it doesn't really matter what it looks like from inside. Right, there we go. So that's going to look exactly the same when the pink wall is there. Okay, for now though, while I don't have the pink wall, for now, I'm just going to fence this place off. I'm actually going to bring the pink sheep inside this place. But we need wheat and I had a lot of wheat, but I don't know where it is. There it is. Oh, it really does look shit from this side, doesn't it? I guess I've got to make it a thing where, where every time I come into the village, if I'm going to go this way, I have to go like this. And then look at it once I get far enough. And maybe while I'm here, while I have the wool, I'll replace some of the floor with the wool. Because we're going to be doing this at some point. I mean, I'm going to need a lot of pink flowers to get enough to do this and that. Here's one of them. Is this Malcolm or is this the nameless one? It's the nameless one. I've got a name tag actually, so I'm going to name him. I've got six... Just dropped my phone. I've got six name tags, so I can name quite a few of my animals actually. There you go, my friend. I'm going to leave you in here. And I'll bring Malcolm. Oh, he's up here with a regular sheep. Well, I'm sorry, Mr. Regular Sheep, but only pink sheep are allowed in here. 
There we go, I'll give you- Oh my god, I didn't even think about that. Wait, so pink sheep aren't even that rare then? Because they, they are rare, because they, they, they don't spawn often, but you can breed them. So if you can breed them, you can get as many as you want. I'm not going to breed them, I don't think. I only gave them the wheat, just because they followed me all the way. But at least it looks like they're going to use this place. There's not much to do in there. Now we've got three pink sheep, and maybe more in the future. I'm not going to fill the place up with pink sheep, but I'll give you some. Oh. Oh, you can grow them up. You can make them grow up by feeding them. Well, that's going to be it for this video. I've been recording for two hours. It took me two hours just to do that and that. And it's funny because he doesn't, this one doesn't even use the place that I built for him. This one really doesn't look as good as I thought it would. Not sure what it is. It just doesn't look the same as the one in the picture. Might be the stupid fence I've put around it. But to be honest, it needs to be there or he's going to escape. But this... I like this. So I'm going to place them offline and try and find some uh, pink flowers over the next few days. And I'll probably build my panda thing off camera too, because I don't really want to make videos just building things like this. I want to be doing stuff. So thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here, and I'll see you all in my next video.